So, morning everybody. So, this morning we've got Rainbow 8K, and guess who's back? Training with us. Yep, a reoccurring member of the vlog here. So, we're about to get in and start the warm up, and we've got 700, 400 swim, 300, 50 kick, 100 swim. So, see you in there. set today is 300 white, three 150s pink, 50 clear, then two 300s white, pink, dash pink, three 150s red, and then a 50 clear, and then three 300s white, pink, two 150s blue, and then a 50, and then four 50s as three blue, one clear, and then four 300s white, pink, and then two 150s purple, and then four 50s as one clear, three purple, and then eight of them then. So let's get into it. So that's just, we're past the 150s red now. Um, I'm feeling all right, to be honest. Just, we got down, we're getting into the hard part with the 50s. So that's a little check in for midway through the set. But what's up, everybody? So I just thought. Uh, so that we did a hard set on the Wednesday night. We, you've just seen the video. I just thought how I would put like a thing on how you would approach a hard session like that. So I just thought, you know what? I'll sit down and say how to do it. So personally, that's how I would do it. And probably Daniel as well, because we probably have the same mindset during it. So the 300s on the set, it would be mostly... It'd be white. It'd be white and pink. So 150 heart uh, to 150 to 160 big heart rate, whatever that is. And uh, you want to keep it relatively easy, but like you don't want to be like slacking off easy. Like so, like and a like good aerobic intensity. And then we'll get. And then you get into the the 150s. So then it's pink. So pink is like basically. Uh, just slightly harder effort than the 300 but not too much harder because you don't want to die at the end and then you basically get and then you go to the 50 clear then you go back to the three two 300s again easy as you can make it but make sure it's not like slacking off because otherwise you're not going to get the benefit out of it then you get to the one three 150s red and you're like oh you can feel a bit more now so i would say to keep it under control maybe do like a like just chill out on the well i would chill out more on the legs because i'm not a leg driven i'd have a leg driven stroke it's more arms so i would chill out on the legs just maybe like one kick per stroke or a twitch and then uh maybe just do move one kick off the wall that's what i would do mostly in this set on the red part then no, we're on the 300 again same as before then we get onto the hard part the two 150s blue basically this is where everybody starts to race it on the set so then you'll end up going like really quick without getting into the times because everybody's different there's no point in saying times um uh, i would say on the blue ones i'm not really good uh, i'll start two kicks off the wall maybe actually getting into a proper ryth rhythmic stroke so I'll be probably good at higher stroke rate. Maybe if it's a race at the end, last 25, maybe even last 50 if it's that, if I'm hurting, uh, I'll start kicking my legs at proper leg kick, not our, like, crossover kick that we, me and Dan will do. And then, uh, then we get to the 450s, and to be honest, the 50s was just all out, but, like, a slight bit reserved, so maybe not as much leg kick. And then two 150s, purple, all out, there's nothing really else to say. Just kick ever, just try everything, and then four one the four fifties. You get one clear, one per three purple. The three purple is really just head down and grind it out. To be honest, because it was the end of the set, and you're not gonna like save it for for the next session, are you? So you're just gonna go really hard and just try not and try and hold it together. I probably died at the end of it. 
because we're still at kind of earlier season, so I'm still testing out the waters on pacing. But yeah, so that's probably how I would personally go through a set. And I just thought, what well, might just share it. So there you go. So just saw we uh, I was halfway through the set then. Had a pretty good set, we're just building through him, starting to now last through the session, not dying off as bad anymore, which is really good, positive. So just have my recovery shape from Connecticut and net, and then have a square bar to keep the carbs up with the energy throughout the day. And then we're going to gym now, so roll the gym montage. So we have Wednesday the 11th of October, gym time now, we had a hard rain position this morning, very rough, um, yeah when we get done with this we have the afternoon off so let's enjoy our gym session. Day today, uh, smash that out, and yeah, I'm feeling 24 years old today, but I'm feeling like I'm 18 still, and I look 18, you know. What is up everybody, today we are making this hot and sour uh, beef noodles, so let's get into it. Be 
honest. I don't know what kind of pepper that is, but it's quite small, so normally we get a bigger pepper. everybody it's the start of the wednesday night session as you saw what did we do before this we had a bit of lunch had a bit of a stir fry and um now we're on with this session we got right now 500 where you go 25 kayak where you basically get the board and you use that as your like your row thing on the kayak and then 100 some for 500. So now we have four, three, four 350s as 100 free, 25 back, 75 free, 25 back, 50 free, 25 back, 25 free, 25 back, and yeah. So we just finished the session and uh, how did you find it, Anna? It was great actually. I thought it was going to be quite long, but we got through it and it was very enjoyable actually in the end. 7k of speed and pulse. So, so now we're probably going to be going on to, we're, we're just doing a tour and social at the end. And then back for dinner. I think we've got risotto tonight. So, sure, that's my favourite meal of the week. Is that yours? What? What's your favourite meal of the week? None of them. Alright, well, I'll see you at home.